Some Louisiana pelicans have been given a new chance on the Texas coast. They were rescued from coastal areas contaminated with oil from the Deepwater Horizon spill. They were cleaned and transported to the Aransas National Wildlife Refuge. The state of Texas itself provides enough habitat that's suitable for uh, the release of these particular species. The 115,000 acre refuge provides vital habitat for coast wildlife, including the largest flock of endangered whooping cranes living in the wild. The rescued pelicans from this late June release appear to be adapting. One of the things you look for for animals or for wildlife is do they go out there and did they start preening? Um, you know, whenever a, a pelican starts preening, it's indicative of they can. They, they can focus on, on preening as opposed to just surviving. And so the fact that these birds hit the water and immediately started preening, it was like a bathtub out there. You could see them. They were flopping around and preening and um, really seemed to, you know, seemed to be enjoying themselves. So I think that's an indication that these birds, they were happy to be out on that water. Wildlife specialists will be monitoring the birds. Every bird that's released following rehabilitation it receives a stainless steel leg band. It's a standard U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service bird ID band. It has a unique number, so if any of these birds are ever recaptured anywhere, we can tell where they came from and, and what their experience was here in the spill. At least on their first day in Texas, the pelicans were making themselves right at home got together as a group, have been preening, cleaning their feathers, and now are starting to distribute themselves around. 